this is my pocket gopher. Uh, he's very young. Uh, I've had him for about two weeks, and I've just uh, I've been gone for a week, so I'm starting up hand training again. So I've got my bite proof glove on, and uh, he's he's very good with the glove, but you take the glove off, and he's not so good. He uh, he really thinks fingers are food. Oh, so I've got some apple. I'm trying to feed him, but he's a little nervous still. So I'm just letting him wander around the floor a little bit. Trying to keep him out from underneath things. Let him climb around on me, get used to my scent. <laughs> you, uh, also getting him used to just getting picked up. There you can see a little bit of his, uh, the white tip on his tail. See, he, he just nibbled on the glove. He does like doing that. He's very cute. I oh, he's very clumsy. His name is Dozer. Oh, there he bit me. I'm trying to show you his feet if you'll uh, let me. I think they're really cool. Yeah, you can see. Oh, he really likes to try and climb, but he's really not very good at it. Yeah, there's a good view of his feet. He's got such long front toes for digging. Because uh, they burrow. Uh, I've been feeding him this special seed mix. Uh, I've got... Uh, seeds... Like uh, corn, sunflower seeds, uh, stuff like that. I've got these little rodent pellets, and then I've got alfalfa and the occasional peanut. And then I also, along with my pet mouse, I love offering him fresh food, like apple, potato, uh, any fruit really, or vegetable. And uh, that's Dozer.